All right, what's good, everybody on YouTube? It's your boy Marty. I'm back, hey, with another reaction video, man. Today we're gonna be reacting to five YouTube, <laughs> five dead YouTubers. You know what I'm saying? Um, basically five YouTubers who died. Um, I wouldn't even call like YouTubers regular people. You feel me? Because like a lot of people are kind of shy and like scared to let people in with with shit that's going on in their life. You know what I'm saying? And an inside look on their life. So, like, you know what I'm saying? Every YouTuber, I don't care if you're small or big, bro. Every YouTuber is unique in their own way because, like, we just throwing a little piece of our life and our personality out there for everybody to see. But enough of that gospel, man. Let's get into it. Five dead YouTubers, man. Let's see. I ain't never seen this, you know what I'm saying? And I believe it's probably, like, some motherfuckers I ain't never heard of either. You know what I'm saying? The stuff you don't industry, like online video, many often forget that all of our favorite online personalities are only human. So today, I want to take a little bit of time to talk about five YouTubers that are no longer with us. Justin Carmichael had a very early retro gaming channel in the YouTube space. Say you love Mario and my mom. Wario all the way back in 2007. Although his channel was never the biggest, he did have many friends through the medium, with a lot of involvement through that guy with the glasses.com. This made it even more disheartening when in early 2014 his wife let his viewers know that after a long battle with depression he ended his life. In a post to her Facebook page, he killed. wrote, I also have to confirm he shot himself, but he was not alone. He locked himself in the bathroom and I was on the other side of the door talking with him. He knew I loved him. He knew all of you loved him. You all made him so happy. After the news hit, many YouTubers, including Angry Joe, The Unnecessary Podcast, and Happy Console Gamer made videos sharing good memories of Justin so that he would never be forgotten. Then this thing was 44. That's crazy. Niggas is really killing themselves. Bro, depression is real, bro. Hold up. Depression is real, bro. Like, um, I know a lot of people want to, like, deny if they depressed or not, bro, but, like, Nigga, just, like, come out with that shit, you feel me? Because, like, you can actually talk to somebody and get some help, for real. It's some it's some serious help that somebody can... that people. It's people out here that can help you, you feel me? So I advise everybody, if they feeling down some type of way, if they feeling depressed, you know what I'm saying? Go get some help, man. Your life ain't worth that shit at all. At all. While her channel continued to grow, something strange happened when one day her video stopped coming out. As many articles say, her sister and a few friends later confirmed that she had died in surgery from an infection of the lung. But this is where it gets confusing. Through all my research, I found many websites that list her as deceased, but I was having trouble finding a reliable source such as a newspaper to confirm her death. Then I realized that most say she passed away in 2013, even though she kept on making videos into 2014 and had left comments on her channel in 2015 explaining that she no longer makes videos. After this confusion, I then finally realized that her sister had taken over the channel before deciding to stop making videos altogether. But this just goes to show how easy it could be for a YouTuber to fake their own death if they really wanted to. All I would have to do would be to stop making videos and have someone say I died. With a video catalog that goes all the way back to 2006, Ed's World has been a very influential channel, paving the way for many online cartoons. See, I ain't gonna flex. These are a lot of videos I ain't never, a lot of YouTubers I ain't never seen, bro. cancer for most of his career, and in 2012 died after a six-year battle. Now, in most cases, when a creator passes away, their series just stops being updated. But that wasn't the case with Ed's World when some of his friends started an Indiegogo campaign to keep the show going with all proceeds of the animations being donated to cancer research. By the end of the campaign, they were able to raise over $80,000 to keep That's what's Ed's up. legacy alive. That's what's up. Brian, or otherwise known as Yogi Slayer on YouTube, ran a gaming channel that became known for his Let's Plays of the Borderlands 2 video game, as well as Call of Duty to a lesser extent. His promising career, though, took a sudden turn for the worse in 2013 when he lost his life. As reports show, the popular gamer after a night of partying was driving home with two other people in the car when he tried to beat out a train, but unfortunately the train won. All three were later pronounced dead at the scene. With this, many other gamers in the community tweeted and made videos paying their respects to their lost friend, as well as others using this as an opportunity 
opportunity to warn against the dangers of reckless driving. For real, bro. Don't be on this shit, bro. Misha TV was a fashion channel run by a mother of three, where she gave clothing advice as well as simple tutorials for creating different looks that really resonated with her viewers. Unfortunately, her life was stopped abruptly when she was shot dead in a case of domestic violence by her ex-boyfriend, Demish Green. After Damn. turning himself into law enforcement for a parole violation, he was later booked into Sacramento County Jail for homicide. This gives Tamisha the sad distinction of being the first major YouTuber to be murdered. After the tragedy, it appears that That's someone crazy. either bought the channel or gained the rights to it through other means, with there still being content and advertisements produced for it that get a fraction of the views that they would have once received. That's crazy, bro. That's wild. But um, hey man, send me videos. Send me send me uh videos to react to. You know what I'm saying? Link to my Instagram is in the description below. Follow me on Instagram, man. Add me on Snap. I'm at everybody back, bro. Um, you know what I'm saying? Like the video, comment, subscribe if you're new, man. Hey, we almost a 5k, bro. Let's get it, man. Let's get it, bro. We almost a 5k, bro. We hey this area.